right where we had left. Now this time I have the timeline game for part six. you rise again and get the antis in that's the deal good job man this helps everybody but especially dr zera and dr ken they can hear each other without static for the first time since whatever see you back at the tower be there as soon as i can to know. My name is Troy. I lead a small group of survivors over in Sector Zero. We call ourselves the Embers. Sector Zero is completely sealed off. Mr. Crane, until you restored radio communication, we didn't know if anyone else in the city was alive. I just wanted to let you know how grateful we are. You've given us a small measure of hope. Uh, well, I'm happy to help. Please wait, please wait. Now it's time to get back to Rice and get that antis in. Okay, it's time. Okay, so guys, there we go. We have reached the top, and what is this? Well, you not only did the job Karim asked of you, but you made it back in one good, piece. Good, good, Bravo. Good, good. Did you think I would be satisfied so easily? You still have plenty to prove. What? Look, we really need the drugs. Let me have them now, and then I'll come back and do whatever. You'll get Antazine when I say you get it, not one second before. But, as I have established, I am not okay. unreasonable. Do all that I ask of you, and I will give you not one, but two crates of Antazine. Very good. All right, fine. What do you want me to do? This will be different from your exploits on the antennas. It will require a bit more persuasion. The imposing of one's will, the creation of one's own rules, that is what makes a man. Okay. Do you live by your own rules, Crane? Or are you merely someone else's puppet? I believe I know the answer. Good. Talk to Karim before I decide you are no longer worth the trouble. Ah, 
my friend. Rice likes you, I can tell. Good. Yeah, how? Because you are still among the living. The task at hand is as easy as can be. You simply have to make a few pickups from some nearby settlements. Which ones? The first is Jafar's wheel station. It's just east of here. But bear in mind, not everyone you talk to today will be in a cooperative state of mind. I'm sure you can be convincing, though, no? I guess I'll have to be. There we go, we are leaving the building. I can't say I'm surprised that Rise went back on his word. Good. But the GRE won't let me just walk away. Plus, if there's any chance that we can get that Antis in, I have to try. So this time he wants me to gather protection money from the surrounding settlements. And after this, he better hand over the drugs. Okay. Okay, guys, so there we go. We are out of this place and... dark in about an hour, so whatever you're doing people, better start wrapping it up and get back to the tower. Crane here. Report. Another job for Rice. This one's pretty dirty. He's forcing me to collect the money he's extorting from a nearby village. Just do what he asks and stay close to him. Okay, Remember what's at stake. Yeah, crane out.
Kareem, I'm by the wheel station. Took you long enough. Get the job done and make it fast. This is just the first stop. All players required. Oh, come on. Come in, guys. Oh my god, waiting for other players to proceed. One guy still left out there. Come on, man, make it quick. Oh, and stood up. My name isn't important. What's important is that Rice sent me, and that you owe him some money. I've never seen you before. For all I know, you're just some random asshole. Fuck off! I'll tell you what. How about I break both your legs and drag you through the streets back to Rice's place, huh? Good. And then he can explain to you that you should have cooperated. Okay, okay! Jesus! You are one of Rice's thugs. You guys are the only ones who act this shitty. Here, here's your money. Take it. And if I have to come back here... You won't get any more attitude. Mi casa su casa. Just don't hurt me, all right? Okay, I won't. I have to go to the next door. Kareem, it's me. So I just threatened to break an old man's legs. And it worked, didn't it? Next, you collect a tribute from the fisherman's village. Head east to the tunnel entrance. Their messenger always meets us there. <coughs> Sun sinking fast. You've got less than an hour to return to your safe houses. After that, you'll be on your own. I'm running errands for Rise. He wields a lot of power, scares a lot of people. Damn right he does. Listen, mate, time's getting short. We're almost out of answers in. As much as I hate to admit it, I'm getting worried. I'm doing the best I can out here, Brecken. I know, I know. I understand. I just want you to be aware of the stakes. I'm infected too, remember? Believe me, I'm motivated. All right, all right. He's hoping you can make it back to the tower soon. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck was that? Hey, Kareem, I just saw something I've never seen before. This huge, bloated infected just fucking exploded. Yeah, we call them bombers. Some of our guys use them to kill other infected. Shoot them, and they take out everything in a three meter radius. You kidding me? Keep your distance and you'll be fine. But what about the courier? Was he there? No, I didn't, I didn't see anybody, just fucking zombies. Directly, I suppose. Okay, guys, bye. Look for a man named Gersel. 